Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be unboxing my S20 Plus and it's really exciting because this is my first Samsung phone in a while. Um, I've been using my iPhone 8 Plus for the past couple of years. Yeah, so when you open the box, you have a plastic cover that they come with it. Um, it's a free plastic case and a quick guide of course to start you up. Then you of course get your phone. I got mine in cosmic grey and it's really pretty. I love it. We also get some AKG earphones. So these are meant to be, they are apparently really really good for listening. So yeah, and of course there are chargers but I already have been using this phone for a while now. So yeah. Great. So now I guess I want to decorate my phone. I've got a couple of stickers and we'll see what we can do. Oh yes, I made that. So that's a little art project I did. We also have a couple of um, photo cards which I collected from my various albums because we want to DIY our phone case and make it very army vibes. Yeah. So I wonder which photo card I'm going to choose. Hmm. Jungkook? Nah. Maybe we'll go for Seokjin because I think the color matches really really well. Great. So should I put a sticker on top of there? It kind of block blocks his face a bit, so not too well. I think the planets look pretty good. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with that. Great, now we're just gonna secure the casing and voila, we have our phone case up and running. So this is my wallpaper of Hobie and this is the first screen you see when you come into my phone. Um, this is my Instagram. So Instagram is one of my obviously most used apps, you know, I use it to connect with friends, to scroll through the news and see what everyone is up to. Then of course we have the IG stories which I would look at what everyone is doing lately. Then we have Spotify because I can't do without my music. This is a, a playlist I got from... Oh! So this is my playlist, Monday Vibes. If you guys want to listen to my music, you can definitely check it out. Um, yeah, I created this playlist and... Next we have YouTube. So YouTube is where I watch so many different vloggers and just BTS mainly. Then we have Netflix, currently watching The King Eternal Monarch and it's amazing. Yeah, so I'm currently up to episode 4. And what I really love about the Samsung S20 Plus is because it has a really wide screen. You can even zoom in so it looks really really great and you get the maximum use of the phone display. Then we are going to head into, well, I think one of the apps I use, obviously my UOB banking app and LinkedIn. LinkedIn is great because I can find jobs there, look what companies, uh, job positions are available and also check in, um, yeah. So YouTube Studio is where I check for comments and you know how my YouTube videos are doing. And as an army, you definitely need Rebus where you technically connect with um, your idols because you know they will post IG stories and messages there. So that's where you really keep up with what they're up to. Yeah, that is so cute. There's also a lot of armies who post messages there in case you know BTS might see them. V Life is a great app also. So BTS usually posts a lot of live videos and their run BTS variety shows are on there which I always always catch. Um yeah. Then we have TikTok. So <laughs> this is a great video of a baby on a helium balloon, but yeah, I use TikTok quite a bit. Usually I post on my Instagram too. If you guys want to follow me, just hit and head on to follow and yeah twitter is great 
So on Twitter, you know, I catch up with news on BTS mainly, and if I want to write my thoughts, feelings, what I'm up to. So yeah, definitely filming a video at this point in time. Great, love that. Yeah, so I just keep up with all the news. And my forest app. This is great for productivity. So you can control how much time you want to spend being focused on a certain piece of work. And when the timer sets off,、um, then you can go back to use your phone. So Papago is great for me because I use it to translate English to Korean and vice versa. And yeah, sometimes I want to type messages and put it on Weibo's. So this is what I use. Love it. <laughs> great. So the next app that I usually would、uh, use. Um. Yeah, this is like the secondary screen where you get all the apps there. So yeah, for Teams, Teams is great. I use that for work. This is most of my working apps. So amazing. The calendar is where I have all my um things that I need to take note of. So all the different colored bars, and it's connected to my Google email. So that's great. Everything is connected via Gmail, so I love that. So the next app that I use is Starbucks. You know,、um, Grab when I wanna order in, and yeah, Yes Style is also great. I have a code for that if you guys want to shop on Yes Style. It's a lot of Asian, Korean fashion, so. You can get a lot of clothes at quite a decent price, but do、um, take note of the reviews because sometimes the clothes may not be as of good quality, so you really have to check it out properly. And yeah, for the next app, Clue is amazing. It is to track my period so that I know when my next period is coming, and it's pretty accurate for me because my period is a it comes on a very regular basis. And as you update the app, it actually synchronizes and becomes more accurate over time. So I love this app, and you can really see when is the next period for the following month, and so on. Yay! So SoundCloud is where I listen to some BTS、um, original like music that they produce that they don't put on the album. So just personal music that they write. And yeah, Jimin's promise is great. Scenery by Tay, you guys should definitely check those out. And Pinterest, Pinterest is great for me to get inspiration. Sometimes when I'm doing design work, or if I just want to find inspiration on, like maybe clothing's or whatnot,、um, this is a great place、uh, to find inspo. Yay! Yeah. So the next one is on how I use this really cool feature on my camera app. So this is my friend's、uh, photography account. He's great. Shout out to J Shoots, which you guys should check out his photos. And let's say I like this photo that he took, I can take a screenshot of it, and then I can actually go to my camera app. And in my camera app, there's a filter、um, button, so I click that, and I can actually add his photo as a filter on my phone, which is super cool. I love that.、Um, really, really cool feature. It's like I don't even need Lightroom anymore. If I see any photos I like on Instagram, I could totally just. Use it and it becomes a filter in my camera. So sometimes it's not hundred percent accurate, but I would think it's a very unique feature that I have never seen on my iPhone before. So definitely interesting. Next up, a lot of Korean apps. Hello Talk is great because I just discovered this, and I can actually talk to people in Korea who speak native Korean and practice、uh, my Korean while teaching them English at the same time. So that's great. Then we have Kakao Metro, which I used while I was in Korea. This is amazing because I can just use it to find、um, station that I want to go to. For example, Myeongdong, and if I want to go to, let's say, 
Hansung University. I just click two and automatically they tell you how much won you need to travel there and how long it takes. Yay! So that pretty much sums up my um, S20 Plus. Hope you guys enjoy it. Bye!